Hello everyone. Today we are going to know about uh, how to use static broadcast receiver. Static broadcast receiver are those receiver which we use in the manifest file and uh, they run ever when the app is running. But uh, sometimes we need it. But uh, sometimes we need to just uh, activate it in the activity means uh, when the activity is running. So it would be running our and when the activity is destroyed it would get destroyed so let's do it without wasting our time first here create one uh, class cloud Kotlin class example broadcast and here extend it with broadcast receiver okay it is extended and now it is giving an error so click on this bell and implement this method okay and here change it to the context and this one to intent and delete this now here register it we would register it here so here receiver name and it is getting itself here oh sorry here give one intent filter and give one action here name boot completed and here it is giving an error because we are using android 12 api level 32 and whenever we are using it we should ex set an exported true or a false it is must ok so we have set exported true and here in this on receive we should now here we should also give it one permission uses permission boot completed here this one receive boot completed and here in this example broadcast if whenever the action would receive so it would perform this action okay intent dot action boot completed that equals intent intent dot action and here just what is this equals in java we were using equal but here you should use double equal and here double quotes here now short toast here whenever it would get boot completed so it would show this toast first context and here message boot completed boot completed here toast dot length short dot show now this is now whenever it would uh, the boot would be completed so it would show this toast and uh, it was all uh, that uh, how to use static broadcast receiver here we use it for whenever we our app is running uh, it would get uh, running in the background or anywhere but because it is not destroying with anything and uh, beside this we using dynamic uh, receiver and that is good because we unregister it so it won't work but this uh, is also giving some leakage problem because uh, when other apps uh, is performing this because if any other app is performing this action it would also send a message to the, that uh, apps so it's not a good uh, way to send message to any other app without uh, its permission or anything so we should use dynamic receiver but uh, I was just uh, giving you a way how to use it the static receiver if you got the idea how to use static receivers so please hit the like button and also subscribe to this channel and uh, click on the notification bell to get updates of videos